Matthew chapter number 3, verse number 2, and saying, Repent ye, for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. This message that John preached in the wilderness is the exact same message that Christ preached. If we come over here to our treasury of scriptures, there is an abundance of scriptorial material to back this up. Matthew, the fourth chapter, verse number 17. From that time, Jesus began to preach and to say, Repent, for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. And I'm just going to scroll through this. You can read these scriptures. It's just a wealth of information. This is the gospel that Jesus preached. This is the gospel that Jesus commanded the apostles to preach when he sent them out. Repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. And then he told the apostles, heal the sick, raise the dead, cast the devils out. Freely you've received this power. Freely you give this power. This gospel of the kingdom of heaven is at hand. But first, repent was the key. Why is repenting so important to even get started? If you look at God's commandments, and we're just going to look at the Ten Commandments, or a few of them, just to start out with, when you do not repent, what you're saying is, my own way is good enough. I do not have to change. You are not acknowledging any mistakes. You are not humbling yourself to the sovereignty of the Father. In fact, you have made your ways God's. And you will not humble yourself before God's way. Because the scripture tells us all have sinned and come short of the glory of God. That's the reason why all must repent. And it's a simple process. Acknowledge you are wrong and accept Christ into your heart. If you do not repent, let's look at a few of the commandments. I am the Lord thy God. When you refuse to repent, you're saying, no, you are not God. You are not my God. My way, my thoughts. What I do is God. Then let's go to the second one. Thou shall have no other God, plural, before me. You've broken that commandment as well. Because once again, you are holding on to yourself or someone else or something else. Whether it's a statue or whether it's an intangible. But you are holding on to other gods. Then you can just go on. We can just go on. Thou shalt not make unto thee any graven image. That's talking about making a statue or making something physical. But once again, when you start down the path of not repenting, you start down the path of breaking so many of the commandments of God. That is the reason why repentance Repenting is so important. Repenting is basically doing a U-turn. And it's very easy. It's just acknowledging to God who you are. And it says, For the kingdom of heaven is at hand. What is the second part of the equation? The kingdom of heaven. We're going to pull this out in part B. Lord, we thank you and we praise you and we bless you. We give you the glory. Thank God. Amen.